your main ambitions when you was a little boy, uh, very young, you wanted to go in show business. And I think you probably have accomplished some of the things that was in your mind that you want to accomplish. And so now you feel that if you had to do it again, you'd rather be a doctor. No, I, so I guess it's think a lot of things changed. I'd rather be. <laughs> but uh, I don't know if I wouldn't still be a performer. Because in this life, I just, I love music, and music is, is my love, you know, it's, it's all I know. But um, if I, if I, I'm thinking that if I were not musical, if I didn't have talent, musical talent somewhat, that I'd probably enjoy being a doctor. You know? I like to make people feel better. Well, I can say that you have always loved people. Whoops. Even from a small child, you know, when father used to take you to church, where all other children, you know, would be sitting down where they belong. <laughs> you have to get up in the rostle somewhere if you have to sit on a little edge of it or somewhere near the piano. So you can see the little head sticking up. He's a little small fella, but that's, that's where you Mar always that's find the way, yourself. That's the way Marvin is. Now around he's got the, to be on the stage. As people say, you, you was found always among the doctors and the lawyers, the preachers, the deacons, or somebody. You wonder where children was. Well, <laughs> you don't find me around too many lawyers today. <laughs> Few deacons, yeah. Yeah, well, why not the lawyers? Well, they're, they're <laughs> terrific. <laughs> How'd you like the concert last night, anyway? I probably can't express it to you exactly how I felt, but it was a terrific feeling to know. I think about my son. <laughs> and after a moment, and with the people, you know, I guess my joy from the people, the reaction of the people. When, the, when I see the people react and that they love you and the way they are applauding and screaming, I really don't see you that much. I'm looking at the people. 